When we think of public service professionals, we often think of military, fire, and police personnel. The following is a story of a public servant whose monumental impact often goes unnoticed. We're here with uh, Principal Kathy Riding from Columbia Elementary here in West Jordan, Utah, and we are going to discuss with her uh, her career in education and have her tell us a little bit about the legacy she plans to leave. Um, first I'll say I, I used to work and sell real estate and um, get, got a nice check <laughs> when I did that. And uh, then I decided I wanted to be a teacher. I hadn't really planned on it my whole life, it just seemed like I was that kind of happened. And um, my principal brought down my first check to the class and presented it and said, here you go, you, you, you pay for what you do. And my students said, oh, that's why you do this. And I said, in December, I made as much as I made for my first check at real estate. So all those months added up made equal to one real estate check. As a teacher and an administrator, principal writing influences both children and parents. What we're trying to do for the students is we're trying to help them make choices on their own that will benefit them in school and throughout their lives. And so we've incorporated Stephen Covey's habits of highly affected people on a kid's level and we work with the kids to make choices and this is the, the habits that they work on for in, inner self and then they work on these as a public, the way they work with other people, and then this is how they regenerate themselves so that they can continue the cycle. And uh, we try to connect a lot of what we do with our habits because if the students can make wise choices, they can actually be able to be more productive in life and also in our schools. Where I feel like I um, spend some of my time that's pretty important in elementary that you might not in a middle school or high school is with parenting. And um, if I can get parents to understand their role and take that role seriously, some of them are not able to at certain times in their life, and I understand that. But if I can help a parent improve, I've helped the whole family. And that's why we have our learning center. And uh, we started out with with moms that felt pretty beat down, some of them, and not worth much. And now they're on the internet looking up how to do things and showing other people. They're writing resumes. They may never go to work, but they're recognizing their qualities. And they're, the pride we feel in those moms is just amazing. And so their expectations for their kids has changed. And now they're focusing on their students' needs rather than just their own needs because they feel like they're productive. And so I feel like I have the greatest influence when I help a parent. When I interviewed to get a job, the principal that was interviewing me didn't think I could see what he wrote down. And I, he was asking me why I wanted to be a teacher when he wrote down, pie in the sky. <laughs> and I thought, you're right. I believe I can change the world one kid at a time. And I think most teachers believe that. And we, we want only teachers like that in education because those are the ones that make the difference. I want kids to go away knowing that they can do it. And that's going to be a, a real connection for me because I was one of those kids. And uh, so I'm very passionate about this. Um, my teacher in fourth grade made a difference. Um, he told me I could wash my face and comb my hair. He told me I could do it. And um, there's a lot of kids here like that. And I want them to know they can do it. And um, so I'm really passionate about this job. <laughs>